नमस्कार इंडिया मेटोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट वेलकम टू इन डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग सो इन द हाइलाइट्स ऑफ द डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग एज द हीट वेव कंडीशन आर प्रिवेलिंग ओवर ईस्ट इंडिया एंड द पेनसुलर इंडिया सो दीज हीट वेव कंडीशन एंड सीवियर हीट वेव कंडीशन ओवर वेस्ट बंगाल आर लाइकली टू कंटिन्यू ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट फाइव डेज एंड ऑल्सो द कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ फोरकास्ट ओवर द थंडर स्टॉम ओवर द नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया फॉर थंडर स्टॉम एंड एंड लाइटनिंग एंड गस्टी विंड विद लाइट टू मॉडरेट रेनफॉल ड्यूरिंग ट्वेंटी सिक्स टू ट्वेंटी very likely so if we look into observed weather so today again uh, the uh, heat wave conditions severe heat wave conditions have been observed over uh, west bengal uh, over, over both subdivisions of west bengal gangetic west bengal as well as sub himalayan west bengal and uh, heat wave conditions have been observed over bihar over odisha and over uh, uh, interior karnataka coastal andhra pradesh and rayal seema uh, during past 24 hours ending at 8:30 hours ist of today and the hill Hill storm activity has also been observed at one or two stations of uh, Madhya Maharashtra, Vidarbha, and uh, southern parts parts of East MP. And heavy rainfall has been observed over Arunachal Pradesh and Assam and Meghalaya, as uh, predicted by the India Meteorological Department, uh, with very heavy rainfall activity over Assam and Meghalaya and light to moderate rainfall at many places of Assam and Meghalaya and. Uh, Arunachal Pradesh. So this is the maximum temperature map, and we can see that the temperatures are running uh, 40 degree and above over uh, the areas which has been uh, which are here in the dark shade of the areas of Telangana, uh, uh, Telangana and Rayal Seema and coastal Andhra Pradesh, Odisha and Gangetic West Bengal, and also some parts of uh, East UP is also showing uh, above 40 degree centigrade temperature. and here also we can see that the uh, maximum temperature departures are very high over this area of uh, sub himalayan west bengal uh, gangetic west bengal bihar as well as uh, uh, parts of uh, western assam so if we look into uh, heat wave warning uh, next 5 days so uh, the heat wave warning as uh, as yesterday is continuing today as well and we can see over here that over interior karnataka and over odisha uh, west bengal and as well as bihar the severe heat wave conditions are likely uh, next uh, next 5 days with the the uh, distribution of severe heat wave conditions over west bengal being the maximum uh and also heat wave conditions are likely during next 5 days over uh, jharkhand over east up and over coastal andhra pradesh telangana and rayal seema during next 5 days uh, also west up is uh, likely to be uh, uh, come in 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 this heat wave uh, uh, conditions uh, from 26th of april uh, especially the uh, southern parts of west up the area including agra mathura and the bundelkhand region and here we can see that uh, this heat wave condition uh, is is also uh, this is also continuing over uh, west bengal since uh, 17th of april and over odisha since 15th of april so uh, uh, about 7 to 10 days uh, has has uh, passed uh, for the heat wave conditions over these areas so the condition has become uh, severe over these areas due to the heat wave conditions and uh, 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 this heat wave condition is uh, likely to continue with the uh, orange color over all these areas uh, which uh, uh, which uh, uh, has been forecasted to be uh, under the grip of severe heat wave conditions and uh, uh, with the yellow uh, color for uh, for the areas with heat wave conditions and as discussed yesterday the heat wave conditions are the situation where maximum temperature goes uh, uh, 4.5 degree above the long period average and severe heat wave conditions uh, uh, is the situation when maximum temperatures goes uh, 6.5 degree centigrade above the long period average uh, then uh, we come over to the uh, uh, the western disturbance which is currently over eastern parts of iran and neverwood and there is also a trough uh, roughly along uh, 50 degree of uh, longitude uh, embedded in this uh, cyclonic circulation and due to this we can see uh, certain uh, clouding over this area of uh, iran and afghanistan so this uh, western disturbance is going to impact uh, northwest india from 
tomorrow and under the influence of this uh, fairly widespread to widespread uh, light moderate rainfall is likely over the uh, Himalayan region over Jammu Kashmir, uh, Gilgit, Baltistan, Mujafrabad, Himachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand during 26 to 28 as we can see here uh, uh, deep green to deep blue colors uh, showing over j and k over Himachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand during 26 to 28th with maximum intensity on 27th and uh, also isolated to scattered rainfall is likely over Punjab, Haryana, North Rajasthan and uh, western parts of uh, UP uh, uh, during this period. The maximum intensity is likely to be on 27th of April with the also probability of uh, isolated heavy rainfall activity over J and K on uh, 27 and 28 and over uh, uh, over uh, 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 Himachal Pradesh on 27th of April and then if we come over to the uh, uh, Northeast India then uh, uh, over Northeast India the the uh, heavy rainfall spell which was continuing over the region since last four to five days uh, is uh, likely to be seized from today and uh, and uh, now there is no uh, 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 likelihood of uh, such a uh, spell of heavy rainfall activity although there is a uh, a marginal possi possibility of isolated heavy rainfall over Arunachal Pradesh and Assam on 28th of April. So that's all for today. Tomorrow we'll again meet with Delhi weather briefing for weather warning during next five days. Thank you and goodbye.